what you're dealing with here is a uh, chalk palanic. We're going to see him tomorrow in Boston, and uh, I'm wearing Boston. a wedding, I'm wearing a wedding dress in Boston uh, on a subway. So I hope that I get shot. Shimona. What are the origins of this painting? Well, the origins, you know, I mean, Chuck obviously makes a lot of references to wiping his ass with the Mona Lisa, and uh, or maybe, maybe not. So he, I don't know, he mentioned something about the Mona Lisa falling apart, and you know, you know, the, the, one of the most revered paintings of uh, of all time. To show him, you know, that, that I find him as a, a, a very revered individual. Uh, Aside from that, you know, the fact that he's beautiful helps. Why did you paint this picture? Why did I paint this picture? Uh, mostly to piss off my father. <sighs> did it work? Yeah, my father goes, Ugh, it's disgusting. <laughs> like, a after I worked on it for like eight fucking hours, he's like, It's filthy. I was like, Are you, are you serious, old man? Maybe you should have hit him. Dude, I would have hit him, but he's fucking, he's ethnic, you know? Well, you know, a lot of fans, uh, if they could, they would just take and take from the Polonic. Uh, they'd rip his clothes off and just, you know, but <laughs> not Gigan and I. You know, we're, we're, we're really, I, w I would like to think of us as the fans that, you know, any celebrity would cherish, you know, because we, we enjoy giving back. And uh, so I made him this painting. Gigum gave them uh, some some random artifacts. Uh, you know, aside from that, you know, I'll probably offer him a foot massage. You know, because uh, I mean, the man is quite frankly, quite frankly, the man just deserves it. I'm Gigan, and uh, you know, me and Nami, as Nami may have said, we really felt we need to get back to him. You know, as much as we could. You know, and we really wanted to be remembered by. So. Uh, I came up with the idea, I'd buy him a book that I knew would really fit him, because he loves unique philosophies and unique outlooks on life, and very interesting stories, so I got him The Seekers, relatively unknown book, but it's very good. Well, can, we, can we see another close-up of The Seekers? Story about a bounty hunter, one of the best books I've ever read, lots of great stories, lots of great philosophies. Before I got him this book... I submitted three things to my college for publication, not expecting them to be picked up. One was about legalizing drugs, and they didn't pick that one up, because apparently they don't understand libertarianism. Uh, another one of my essays was about sneaking food into movie theaters. And my third was about making a film with uh, some high school students who were terrible. And um, that got submitted and won, so I signed it for Chuck as though he would sign it for me, and life is good. And I, I might point out, you know, Nami did such a beautiful job on his submission to the Polonic. Oh, thank you, thank you, yeah, yeah. As you see, it's beautiful. Uh, I got nice little subjects <coughs> on it. Uh, spent many an hour. <coughs> the, the tiniest of details were not overlooked, including the kiss. Yeah. Which I might say is a glorious artifact. So tomorrow we're going to be presenting this to the man, and, you know, we're going to give you his reaction. Alright, come show it off, boy. I'm here, uh, in Boston, uh, in my filthy dress, kind of wearing on me, uh, all for the Chuck Polonick, dude. Lo all for Chuck. Love it and live it, man. Love it and live it. When's the wedding? Today, actually. Chuck, me and my friend come bearing gifts. I got you one of the best books I've ever read. It's got a bunch of interesting stories in it. Okay. And unique philosophies and everything. I know you'd be into it. All right. And I got published, so I wanted to present you with that. I'm on page 18, and I signed it for you. So it's an anthology? It's uh, for my college. Uh-huh. Uh, they make a publication, they publish one of my essays. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh,
I'll get something to read on the plane. <laughs> uh, hold on. Yeah. Oh, and I got a question for you. Are postcards from the future in the like pixie story? Yeah. Did you ever actually get to keep the pixies? Oh, yeah. The pixies are rotting in my attic right now. Nice. nice. No one ever found out about it? Yeah, my sisters did. But uh, I don't think they would use them any either. So G-A-R-R-E-T-S. And maybe this Christmas we'll uh, we'll get together and we'll divvy them up. So nice. We'll each have some pixies to ignore. Thank right. you. Congratulations. Thanks. It's nice to meet you. Thank you. Jeff, the pleasure. I, uh, you know, so you, lovely. You know that, you, uh, those, that dress makes your arms look huge. Oh, thanks. <laughs> you know, I, I, get, I get that from all the guys. All uh, right. <laughs> um, before I forget, oh, here is a coupon since you dressed oh, up sweet, so man. nice. Thanks, dude. It's got an address on yeah, it. Yeah, I wore this on the subway, so it's <laughs> rather interesting. Yeah, it's changed I can't imagine. <laughs> um, send that card to the agency that's listed there and include awesome. your mailing address. And when tour wraps up, I'll send right. you something to us. Thank you very okay. much. Um, well, you know, I feel that you give a lot to the fans, and so I want to give back. Oh, and oh <laughs> my <laughs> and God. And I wrote you a little oh love note God. in the back. <laughs> so, uh... Like the Chuck Da Vinci coat, and it's still yeah, wet. Go figure, man. <laughs> I can't wait to put this in my luggage. You'll, you'll, you'll remember. You'll remember me from that paint. Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, yeah, but this is a keeper, definitely. <laughs> so, oh my gosh. Thank you. Yeah, I put qu quite a few hours into it. Um, Gigging. And uh, I know I'm afraid of wrecking books with my big inky. Oh, please, by all means, you know, like uh, like Stephen King bleeding on books. Oh, you heard that story? Yeah. Oh, if I ever meet him, he's going to be so pissed at me. I got it at Goodwill. I do a lot of shopping. Yeah, and they wanted 50 bucks for it. Wow. Yeah. And so you stole it? Well, it, I, I, uh, I prefer I to use the term schmooze. Okay. <laughs> I, I've got a lot of connections at Goodwill. So. Oh, connections. Yeah. <laughs> wow, at Goodwill. That's a power broker. <laughs> you are still the player. All right. Thank Thank you very much. changing in the dress on the yeah, subway. Yeah. The yeah. Back. The poor kid with the paper pack. <laughs> uh, what's your name, Portia? Inhale. Take in as much air as you possibly can. This story should last about as long as you can hold your breath, and then just a little bit longer. So listen as fast as you can. <laughs>